In a Gazette notice, President William Ruto appointed a new team to review the new funding model for universities and TVET institutions. The team will be divided into four subcommittees, each taxed with specific roles, including handling students' categorization for scholarships and loan allocations. A move that has been strongly opposed by civil society groups led by a Limubora working group who are now calling for the committee to be dropped. Let us get back to the basics. The government has a responsibility to fund the institutions of learning. This responsibility should not be transferred to the parents. It should not be transferred to the students. The students are supposed to be just helped to exercise and uh, derive their right to education. Uh, clearly, uh, it's just one year and already they're forming a committee to look at it. Let's go back to the old model which was easily understood uh, by learners, even by, by those ones who are issuing those loans. And it would, it would easily tell you how much you're going to, be, to, to own uh, the, 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 the people who are issuing loans by the end of your coursework. So it's, it's, it's clear. This was not a well thought uh, uh, model. We need to actually call for its uh, immediate stoppage. The new funding model has faced criticism with various groups, including parents and students, voicing concerns. Uh, you find that there are a number of students who are coming from, uh, I'll say, uh, low earning backgrounds and who can hardly afford to pay for their fees. You find such students have been uh, given higher bands like band five, a student who cannot even raise uh, his, his or her basic needs. The band I'm placed in is not favorable to me. Uh, as I consider the background which I, I come from, I've been placed in band five, but I hear even from other students, they are complaining because majority are in band five, band four. Despite the strong opposition, President Ruto has remained steadfast in defending the new model, insisting the system advocates the for the different component. levels of vulnerability Again. among students. The banding did not start with this, band, with this model. Everybody should know that. We, all, we started the banding in 1996. There has always been banding. It didn't start with this model. John Matava, Prime Africa News, Nairobi.